Hey YouTube, it's Lost My Hair. I've got another Tesla video for you, and this time it's on the newly released Advanced Smart Summon. How about just Smart Summon? The feature came out about a week ago with software version 10, and at that time I did what uh, the good beta tester will do. I ran it through some paces, but I chose a uh, pretty much vacant parking lot. There was only a couple cars there. Um, you know, this, this testing is stuff that Tesla is sort of expecting us to do, feedback information to the mothership so that uh, it can make the system better. Um, I'm, not, I'm not willing to go do this in a Walmart parking lot. I think the people that do that are a little bit insane, but uh, to each their own. I understand the risks, and that's probably why I'm a little more reluctant to doing that. For those of you that don't understand what beta software means and are interested, I plan on releasing a... Uh, video in a couple days helping to clarify what exactly the risks and uh, sort of liabilities are with something like that and what you should sort of take into consideration when playing around with these beta features. But in this case, this was an empty parking lot for the most part. I have three runs for you to check out. The third run, which was using Smart Summit, is what you see pictured here. And I'm not going to spoil it, I'll just say it didn't go as expected. The first one was using uh, come to me feature and this is a, a simple little navigate through the parking lot islands to get to the destination. This is something the car had done several times previously and in this case for whatever reason it is, maybe it was because of the orientation when it started, I'm not sure, but it decided to completely take a different route than I had ever seen. Um, and it actually didn't quite make it to me as you'll see. Round. Oh, that's interesting. And it's going to make a second loop. Where the heck is it going? Bye, car. Okay, now it's going to come back. Try this all over again. Should be able to see that there's a curb in the way. Thinks it's there. It's close enough. But not right here. The second run was also using come to me and in this case there was one car between the Tesla and me and the Tesla disappeared behind it and without being able to see what was going on I wasn't too comfortable so I had the car stop and decided to take a look to figure out if it was going to be a risk and ultimately I think the car would have done just fine getting around without me stopping it but uh, it was a little too early and a little too high of a risk for me at that point. I'm really nervous about other cars. Under summons, it's got the smart summons. I'm going to show you a map of where you are. The car is parked over there. Maybe I have some packages that I can't carry it. Or maybe it's raining and I want it to come to me. I can uh, just tell it to go to the target. Let's see if I can get this to... Car starts up.
This time it went forward first. Normally it goes backwards when I have it parked the other way. Let's see what it's going to do. Looks like it's going to navigate around this island the right way. I'm going to pause right here because we got a bit of a problem. If the car takes the path as shown on the map, this isn't going to work because the car can't go over the island. So it's either got to go left or right. If it goes to the right, like is shown here, we'll be okay. But let's see what happens. Whoa, 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 not so quick, Buckshot. Whoa. That was a little bit scary. What you doing over there, car? Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh-uh. You are way too close for comfort there, mister. I am not going to let you do that. You failed. Not a good view. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe. If you're thinking about getting a Tesla, please consider using my referral code. I will give a link and uh, the code below in the description. Tesla is currently offering a thousand miles supercharging. If you use a referral code when you purchase, know that this program does change often. So that thousand, maybe 2000 soon, or maybe even less, who knows? Check with Tesla. And thanks for watching, and I hope to have more videos for you soon.